some of y'all's defensive adjustments are obviously needed from the last time y'all y'all played AM. They had 79 on, on y'all. What what are some of the adjustments y'all are looking at? Um, I would say really just stopping their guards. I know their big is playing a lot better now since um, we last played them. I can't remember his name, but uh, Coleman is playing a lot better now. So um, got to maintain him and the other guard that dominated us last like last game. Just jumping towards the ball and like just being in the gaps and uh, being on ball screens and just really just communicating together. I feel like we had a great defensive game against Tennessee. We just do the same thing and take A&M and make shots. We should come out with a win. Uh, Jalen Bruce mentioned um, when he was talking about your defense against Georgia and Tennessee that your guards had sort of got fed up with everybody talking about how they were getting lit up. Have you sort of noticed that too? Um, yeah, I feel like our guards are just trying to they're trying to win at the end of the day. Even though some of those guys, I mean, they had like the best games of the year, those games. So like, um, you know, it's just in their head, they just want to be locked in. I know they try like to knock out the noise and social media and stuff, but like, they kind of uh, took that, they took it personal and um, adjusted to it and they've been going a lot better. Jalen, when y'all watched the film from that Tennessee game, did y'all feel like y'all were getting good looks and just the ball literally wasn't going in? Um, well, I, I watched, we kind of like moved past it, but it really like watch it as a team, but like I watched it on on my own and just like, I mean, even like the open shots were still like, still contested. Like Tennessee was flying around, like both teams defense was like incredible. But like, um, yeah, just the shots were there. There was a little contested shots that we should make. So. Back to me. Jay, like you were just mentioning, Tennessee's defense is you know, the best in the country this year, but you guys played. Almost, yeah. almost just as well, if not, if not better, on Saturday on the defensive end of the floor. What was working for you guys so well on defense? Um, I would say just playing one on one, making them play one on one. They they were looking to drive and dish and pass. Once they get rise for one, or they get into like the pull up jump shots, they weren't really looking to get all the way to the rim because like they can't really finish over me, Janai, and all of us in the paint. So it's just hard for them to score. Just make them. Make one on one plays with our plan, and that's what we did. How do you think y'all did at the at the five with Dylan? Uh, I think y'all did really good. Um, you know, never played it, hasn't really practiced. Like this is the first week he practiced it, and I find it very well for a, a freshman to play a position that you haven't played all year, and just know exactly like the plays and stuff like that, and just have that energy, and just like I know him and what's the name got into it a little bit. Like he roughed him up a little bit. That was pretty good. Like just stand up for himself and like for us. The uh, Texas A&M, for whatever reason, is giving you guys some problems the last couple of years. You got any idea why that is? I don't know, to be honest, but every time I've played them, it's been a struggle. Since, like, freshman year, like, on that senior night, they came in here and beat us. Sophomore year, we lost there at the buzzer. Junior year, I think we beat them. We split. Or, do yeah, they beat us in the tournament. So, I don't, I don't know. I mean, they're well coached as a team. But um, I just they're always prepared, and we just got to come with it. Back to Jalen, you guys are down by six with under a minute left Tennessee and had a chance to tie the thing up at the very end. What does that say about kind of how this team just continues to fight all the way to the end? Yeah, um, you know, just, we just got to stay together. Even, like, that was a tough loss. But I feel like once we was in the locker room after the game, we, we weren't really, like, we were upset. But it was kind of like, okay, like, if that's the number two team in the country, or now we're like six now, like we can we can win, like we can win more games than most, uh, like these uh, reporters and everyone like believe. Like we just got to guard and rebound, and offense will come eventually. You talking about us, these reporters? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> social media. <laughs> Any other questions, Jalen? Okay, thanks, Jalen. Thanks, Jalen.